Welcome back to Mega Man X8. This is Kung Fu Jesus. Um, we're about to set off and delete Bamboo Pandemonium. And I've bought a few retried chips, life upgrades for Exit Axel, and a Prickle Barrier, just if I, on the off chance, I can manage to get to that upgrade that requires it. So we're gonna go stage select here. Bamboo Pandemonium. Oh, uh, before I do that, I will actually demonstrate Zero's, Zero's super jump. Here we go! The super jump is based on a glitch that happens because on the PC you can press multiple directions simultaneously. And on the PS2, um, it's a bit difficult to do that especially up and down, left and right at the same time. And you can exploit this fact because his the weapon he gets from Dark Mantis, or rather the, the move he gets from Dark Mantis, is this jump up and press the uh, special attack and he spins around and does damage to enemies. Well, what you can do is you can press it and then press down to go down a shaft, say, or down a diagonal to go down a stairway, stuff like that, but you can also press up to stay in the air, it does absolutely nothing, whereas left and right will make you turn left and right, pressing up will just do nothing and keep you spinning in the same direction. Now if I press up and then down, I fly into the atmosphere, and I take a very long time to come down. And that's it. That's the glitch. I can also use it to fly diagonally. Like so. And that's the glitch. Up to you if I can use it or not, but... Uh, I'm inclined not to use it. Except in possibly one area of... Gravity and Onion stage. Good job! You know, the Colonel has, like, this American accent. In X4, he has this crazy South, South African accent, and I love it. I, I don't know, I wish they had kept it. He's like, oh, I've been waiting to fight you. I can't even do it justice. Alright, now, Booster Force. We're gonna use X in his armor with his body parts H. Roger. Now we're gonna use Axel. Here I come! Because of one of Axel's abilities, and I'm not using a navigator because I am navigating. I mean, they can tell us everything about monster weaknesses, stuff like that, but I already know all that. Bamboo Pandemonium! So there he is. We're gonna hyper warp to his stage, and it's gonna be awesome. We're gonna get to use the ride armor in the stage, and uh, Ready. we're gonna get to use Zero or uh, Axel's ability that has almost no practical use in the game, except for collecting collectibles. There's the ride armor. Now, what I did is I made the ride armor. Um, better. I made it more appropriate, shall we say, because the gameplay in the riot armor is definitely reminiscent of another game. Here I come. You hop on Goombas. You destroy paratroopers. Here I come. Basically, you hop on all your enemies to defeat them. It's pretty awesome. Now, okay, I have to get out, and I'm going to copy this little dude here, grab his DNA, and we'll continue to play Mario, and the Mario Twins, they look the same, I can hop on spikes, this is like, I don't know, Berserker Mario, oh, I punch him, whatever, I can hop on those guys too. Remember those shooting turrets from uh, X1? Yeah. Not so big now, are you? Boom. 
Goomba. They look so much like Goombas. Like they're way more annoying. Their bottomless pits, platforming. Hop on your enemies to defeat them. Jump on your enemies, and then grab your enemies, and throw them at your other enemies. I wish I could grab my enemies, and throw them at my other enemies. Now those guys I'm not going to risk jumping on because they drop explosive blocks. Right, come down here. I want to hop on you. There's an upgrade up there. I'm gonna get. And it requires that you uh, jump, dash, jump, dash. Help me out. Leave it to me. X. Light capsule. I thought something like this might happen someday, so I've prepared parts for you. This time, I've got foot parts I for you to try. Equip this part to jump much higher than usual. Equip this new ability and board the capsule X. Okay, this ability, I jump like this high, which is crap. Now watch this. This is the first part of the Icarus armor set. It's red. You'll notice my feet turn red. I hope this is the last time we need to use weapons of war like this X. I really do. I don't. Weapons of War are pretty cool. Now I jump this high. Holy crap. Alright. It's back to Mega Mario! We even collect coins too. How about that? And you know, blow up bricks to get more coins. Switch. I'll take care of it. Okay. Now we're gonna use this transformation ability that he has. I copied that roller guy, so now transform. I'm going to transform into a little ball. Dash around. And I'm gonna get this rare metal here. I don't know exactly what it is. I think it's crappy. But we will muddle through it. Anyway. Make sure to change back to axle bullets so we don't get in trouble later. Okay. gotta one-touch jump those blocks, otherwise uh, they break under your enormous weight. Guess Mario's gotten a little bit uh, bluer and fatter in his old age. The damage I take, you see? Oh man. I got top ranks on that one. I got a purple and metal there in the middle. Alright, now this is the part where I get to use the prickle bear. Yeah. I am morally opposed to spikes and instant death. Morally. I think it would be much better if, say, you hit the spikes, you get a free you get a free lunge for a while, and then if you hit them again within a short amount of time. Then you die. Much like with the trickle barrier that they give you. Now if you're good at this, you can... And there it goes X. Yeah, when you use the prickle barrier, you uh, kind of get lowered to one health. I'm uh, probably gonna die. 
It's just the axle doesn't cut it. Got to make sure we got our. Uh... I'll do that in a second. Warning! Warning! And here he is, Agent Smith. Talking to Morpheus, you know. Actually, that may be if you go up with X. I forget. You have the same copy ability that we new generation Reploids enjoy. Have you ever thought that power could change the world? Now he just sounds like a slow four-year-old. The only thing I think is how it comes in handy when whipping you Mavericks. Such petulance. Not force guns. I suppose sorry. we have no use for you after all. My mama taught me. That old generation red boys were garbage. And that I shouldn't talk to old generation red boys. Oh! Damn. There I go. Actually, did pretty well, considering that Axel kind of sucks. Ready. It'll be all right though. This Warning. time I'll get to excessive Warning. force him, and we get to hear his alternate speech, which sounds like Smith with a. I don't know. I just get that vibe. Did you know that the earliest form of rocketry was missiles used for war? Did you know that humans are a virus? All of history has been spent making things whose sole purpose is to destroy. And now I will destroy you. Missiles, reploids. You talk like a maverick. No reploid wishes for destruction. <laughs> Says the guy who just blew up 50 robots what to get here. What wishes for destruction? Is this world? We're just helping it along and giving it what it wants. Give me what I want and I'll go away. Now that I got ultra super high jump. If you build up a nice combo, it, it helps heal very uh, efficiently the other guy. Yeah, that that attack totally dips. There you go. That punch attack is like, he can dive and you come across the stage, the only hope is to get behind him when he starts winding it up, pretty much. He'll get hit no matter what. Or you could have a lot of help, and that also helps. And we get sort of crappy weapons from this guy. Takes a lot of energy, moves very slowly, blast launcher's okay. Weapon get. In general though? Just quit for the ride armor. That looked like a hard fight, but there was never any doubt that you'd come out on top. Awesome sauce. Welcome back! The rare metal you found has been made into a new chip. Rare metals contain powerful if you manage. Yeah, Great we job, already zero. Know huh? Uh oh. Uh, thanks. Yep, bad poor movie coming up. Zero, have you forgotten already? I'm Palin. This here is Layer. We're the new navigators here. Don't forget about us. Layer wanted to talk to you and waited here the whole time for your return. Right, Layer? Oh, sorry. Anyway, what is it, Layer? Um, I did some research. She has eyes. I'm unable Holy to crap. determine Lumine's location. She's like that Home Depot um, guy, you know? You, anyway, he, like, wears the hat, but you can never see his face. I always hated that guy. Well, no matter I, what the Mavericks are up to, like, it looks like I'll have to stop him. As a small child, he just sort of frightened me. Okay. 
Booster Forest.